less hassle than a bandage. So for having to deal with these little arm openings here. It's about the most uncomfortable thing about it. And part of the problem which is going on right now it's nearly impossible to scratch an itch on your back. Yeah. Because it's so thick. And then the under armor with it does not help. It's Anyway, um, yeah, this is quite amazing. It and it provides like all sorts of support. I mean, I could bounce around, run, whatever the hell I wanted to do, and these things stay in place and it don't hurt. It's quite amazing. It's bugging me back here. Oh, and compared to Ace Bandage, oh good god. This is so worth the investment. <laughs> Ace Bandage, I found myself adjusting almost every half hour. And it was so awkward. Because, I mean, something would slip, and then I would go adjust. And then if I don't adjust in the mirror, sometimes shit would start popping out like this. Like, because it goes straight around your chest like this. And if I try to pull something up because it feels like it's slipping down and shit up here is pouring out, if I bring it too far up, shit from here is <laughs> coming out and, oh good god, I mean, I had it looking like, um, I had like, weird little bump protruding from right here going up, curved up slightly, and then everything else was flat and it was like, oh good god, but um, it's very awkward blind adjusting ace bandage and this I wore it to school all day today and I think yesterday yeah yes I th did I wear it yesterday? I think so. Yeah I did wear it yesterday. Um, I wore it all today and yesterday and I only had to adjust myself like two or three times throughout the whole day and before I was literally adjusting every half hour or so and I had to go to the bathroom and adjust like it should I usually only have to go to the bathroom like once or twice while I'm at school and I would make an extra two or three trips to the bathroom a day just so I could go in there and adjust my ace bandage because I needed a mirror and oh god this shit is a lifesaver <laughs> I feel so much more comfortable with this on, cause um, I, I it's hard to describe. I mean, with a bandage, I never felt um, I, I felt more like a chick trying to be a dude. With this, I don't have to wear a bra. I don't have to adjust every few minutes. I I just put it on and I go. I, I feel so much more comfortable in myself. And, I mean, it looks horrible when I don't have a shirt on because it goes whoop and then get a, a protrude out from here. So, let's see. Let's see? Then that looks sexy. <laughs> but, yeah, it looks quite horrible like this without a shirt on. But where's my shirt? Oh, here it is. Um. Looks so much better with a shirt on. Yes, I know I wear this shirt a lot. But then, see? Doesn't that look good? I mean, you can't really tell shit. I, mean, I, I can still see the little. Yeah, shit I got right here. But being big, you kind of have to expect shit like that. I mean, and now I haven't tried like adding a bandage onto this. And honestly, I don't want to. A bandage sucks. I never, ever, ever, ever want to use it again. <laughs> ever. 
I recommend recommend to any of you out there who are currently using a spandage or contemplating using a spandage hurry up and save the money for an underworks binder because a spandage sucks and this is so much better I mean if you can get used to ace to wearing a spandage this stuff is just like fucking I mean this is probably the next best thing the top surgery I would say I mean, I am so fucking excited over it because I mean, I feel so much more comfortable with this shit on I mean yeah I probably should have gotten the regular size but um because I mean it constricts a little more than it probably is supposed to and um like if I try to stand if I just stand up well actually shit even right now it's kind of making me hunch over slightly to where I might get a little more back problems or whatever but honestly I can just lose 10 or 20 pounds and it'll be fine and all I have to do is remember to straighten myself up and I should uh, avoid back problems but um I love it I love this thing <laughs> Oh, the next few years is going to be so much simpler, <laughs> so much better. I mean, I thought I was going to be stuck with a spanish for a lot longer than I actually was. And this thing, I mean, I'm excited about it now. I probably won't be too excited about it later, but, um, wow. This thing is just making everything so much better. <laughs> I, 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 I don't know, I can't really fucking explain it, it's just amazing. Um, you wouldn't think that a binder would really cause, like, for celebration or uh, nothing, but, uh, this thing does. I mean, I've been binding with Ace Bandage since, I think, like, last July. Yeah, around last... June or July, it was somewhere around there, because I remember I moved in with my mom, like, the end of June. Okay, so yeah, it would have been July. I moved in with my mom around June, and I stole some of her ace bandage, and I started binding with it. Um, just... So yeah, I've been binding for... Nine months? Ish? It's March. I don't. I, I'm no good at math, so I'm just gonna say nine months ish. That I've had to deal with a bandage, and this thing, I love it. <laughs> I will never go back to a bandage again. I don't care how much flatter I would look if I added a bandage to it. This thing is enough for me right now. I mean, it. There, the fucking freedom. I love it. I, I'm fucking stoked about not having to wear a bra anymore. I mean, I just fucking put my Under Armour shirt on, which I've been wearing every day for the last year anyway, which is one of the reasons I gotta replace it. Um, so, I'm, that only took me a couple of weeks to get used to, just have that Under Armour shirt on all the time. And uh, put, that, put this thing over it. I'm good to go, man. I mean, shit. This thing's fucking awesome. I, I definitely recommend the Under Armour shirt, though. Because this thing will not feel good against bare skin. Trust me. Especially for the bigger guys out there. You do not want that against the, those. No. Just, I, I strongly, strongly, strongly recommend getting an Under Armour shirt or something very similar to it because the material it's made out of um, not only uh, oh, Under Armour if you don't know what it is it's this amazing shit that is made like um, it's very slick so it helps this stuff slide over it with like no friction um, so 
I mean, that's one bonus right there. 